Yeah. So what can the crowd expect? Which, what is your characteristics for your live concerts? Tick Monkeys nous ont rejoint. Bonsoir. 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 Hello. Do you like any Audi? Yes. Uh -huh. with, a, with a passion, yeah. Um, I think they're good. He's got he's got a nice physique, I noticed as well. He obviously takes care of himself. <laughs> he's got some uh, some good abs there. Seen him showing them off. Yeah. Do you take care of yourself? Mm, like he did? Not not really. Like you do. I think you can tell just by looking that I'm uh, I'm not in peak form right now. But <laughs> this is off season. This is this is holiday season, so <laughs> I've not been training. But I mean. I am going for an Olympic gold in 2020. <laughs> there, won't be an, there won't even be an Olympics then, but you know that's how good I'll be. <laughs> that I'll still win. What are you going to go for a gold in? Um, probably. You know that one that's walking where they do that. Oh yeah. I can't. I can't describe it. Vocal. Is that? It's you always have to have one foot on the floor, and it's like fast walking, speed walking. Speed walking. Is walking. that more of the leotard? Or? Uh, you can you can wear whatever you want. I think. Okay. It's, uh, <laughs> Freestyle clothing, but I'll go. I'll go for spandex if yeah. you want, Jamie. I'd like that. We couldn't get clothing to fit. Not that like I've put on weight, more that it's just they um, you don't know, make them in my size on the weird side. Uh, so we're just going to use metallic silver paint, and so essentially I'll be naked, but not to the not to the naked eye. How did sexy creep into Arctic monkeys? I mean, I always thought we were pretty sexy. Like, we stopped hiding it. We allowed it to come out. I think we crept in sexy, I think, rather than it, it creeping in us. Yeah. Alex Turner. And uh, and uh, Nick O'Malley. Yeah. I'm just... uh, Nick, the first question is for you. Wow. Uh... What's the biggest What's the biggest difference? Biggest difference? Wow. I, he just threw that in my face there on the spot. I don't know. Last album, the songs were a bit more sort of left, and this one's maybe a bit more closer to the center. I'd say on the dartboard. So we're about 25 points, whereas last time it was probably more like you know around the outer rim. More central this time. Yeah. Slot. Yes. That's a good time. Everyone's everyone just getting the you know, everyone's chips just and everything. Getting, getting the noodles. The shoulder and starts going. Get Set you up by the Tonight I'll be some Into the evening. Shoulder starts going. Foot maybe. Maybe a bit of a... <laughs> uh, yeah. Very sharp. Yeah. Sharp, but not in a, you know, not in a like uncomfortable way. Not uncomfortably sharp, just okay. refreshingly sharp. Like, like plasticine scissors. Exactly. That's good. Yeah. Plasticine scissors. Like a fading tree. Tree. Okay. Yeah. It's been your five-year anniversary with Dark Monkeys. Has it? Right. Okay. Yeah. Have, have they bought Swan you a present? Line. Sorry. Have they bought you a present? Present? No, just just uh, just little sort of snacks every now and again. Yeah, not even a cake. Not yeah. even a cake. For his, for his but I mean, these these guys don't get anything for their their anniversary either for their sixth year. So you know. <laughs> do you do you do you still recall the well the, the actual day that they asked you to to join I don't join know the, the actual day, but I can feel when I'm near to it each year. I get like a warmish sort of sort of there, you know, like when you've had. A delicious dessert. So it's a sweet with a hard shell with a, a gooey reward in center. Try and get a, a, an even mixture, like you know, like all the right ingredients to make a lovely sort of pie. Did you have leftovers or just wrote the songs that were going to be on the record? Um, yeah, I think we might have had one extra one, really. So, really lazy this time. Are you up for best song and uh, best album? Is, do you have a preference as to which one that you? Like It'd be done. Album, yeah. I go for because yeah. the songs on the album, and then you you put them you covered on. Covered it. Yeah, yeah. You don't need the other one. <laughs> but I mean, both would be nice. Saying that. Yeah. Well, uh, the first four years, well, you actually didn't didn't well record uh, an album, but you wrote songs. Um, 
what I was wondering, did you, um, how many songs of the first two or three albums were actually written? Every year you still plan for them. This year I want to take a year off or I have a year off. Um, <laughs> yes. do, you, do, you, do, do you talk about the future a lot with each other? No, fun, no. What about, uh, I mean, the internet in general? What's, what, what would you say your relationship is with it now? What, what do you think of it? In terms Purely X-rated, personally. Yeah. Just porn? <laughs> yeah. Right, right. Like, What's like the greatest misconception there. about Arctic Monkeys? Well, I'm hoping that this X-rated comment that I just made, <laughs> that gets spun and then it's like <laughs> Nick O'Malley, porn addict, <laughs> and it's me and David Duchovny and we're both in rehab together. <laughs> right, right. You're hoping for that? Well, oh, he, I, I just want to meet porn? Dave. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's a sex addict. Yeah. Oh, is that right? Well, was. I don't know. Can you not ever not I be if know. you are? I don't know. Right. How do you, how do you find recovery. The truth he's in recovery. Recovery. Yeah. Yeah. The truth is out there. <laughs> Um, okay, cool. Are you superstitious? Do you have any rituals before you go on stage? Untie and then retie my shoelaces. Really? I think that's more a mental health issue than a superstition. We were like we always used to be the youngest band in the lineup. Uh -huh. Not anymore. Not anymore. Oh, not anymore. Those were the days. So today, how would you fill it up? Do you read? Do you watch movies? What are some favorite things to do? Today, for example, we've been playing Throw the Lime Down the Corridor. We've got a bit of a long corridor where our dressing room is, and it's got a roof on it. So you've got to try and hit the other end of the corridor without hitting a wall or a floor or a ceiling. It's pretty difficult, and that really, really does pass the time. <laughs> that really wiles them hours away. Uh, okay, what's your question? Um, I was wondering what all of your favorite albums of all time are. Wow. Nick? I really like um, Now 41. <laughs> Smash It's 95. Has that got like Zig and Zag on yeah. it? Zig and Zag, yeah. Zig and Zag, Cotton Eye Joe. Um, I really did have that though. Yeah. Hello. So you are romantic people or? <laughs> um, I have, have my moments, yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, I can, I, I can be, but not so much not so much now at this minute but i mean sometimes i can be a, a right lady killer you know with <laughs> with the, with the words and the chat up lines um but not so much recently right up. jamie's the next porn star right <laughs> as well. just thought so, I'd add that. I, have, I have no romance he's, he's not romantic he's just dis, he's just dirty he just <laughs> straight to the point voilà pas romantique vox Directement à la cible. That's not true. Au cœur de ces idées, c'est pas vrai. Pas une, euh... <laughs> Doing awesome stuff. How do you find time for the ladies? For the for the loving. Um, and then. Yeah, we're just easy to just you know yeah. keep it on. Keep it on close circles. We're not so we're not going to we're not going to rush into things. You know what I mean? Do you think that people too put too much weight into what rock stars have to say about non-musical issues? Um, I think they should listen more to Al Gore, <laughs> and maybe Al Gore should make an album, and maybe that could be the way this could work, <laughs> and then things would get solved. But yeah, I, it's, it's the other way. It's yeah, it should come the other way around. Like people that know about these issues should, should become get into the rock music. stars. Yeah, they should get an Akui out. I don't yeah. know. I don't know if I want to hear Al Gore's record. I don't know. I think he's got a bit be of be like Can. I think he's got a bit of jazz in him. <laughs> <laughs> and what is the best thing from the that you've seen in Amsterdam or in Holland? Night -night? I saw them bollards that are penises yeah. okay. in Amsterdam. <laughs> They're like, you know, a bollard on a side of a road. Yeah, yeah. Like that's that, the they were a penis. I'm quite shocked by that. How do you think it will be different this year? Um, different, different songs. View. Different, song. different haircut. I look different haircut. Different haircut. Different yeah, haircut. different haircuts. Good point. How do you see your band in five years? <laughs> five, yeah, it's normally ten. People yeah. normally say ten. Yes. But yeah, maybe just uh, all on steroids with big beards. <laughs> Prodigy. <laughs> um, like we never jam. Go on, go on, give us something gruesome. We require your grief. The books out the thieves and the trials to rob. The words from a goblin take the swords to the innocent. Because. Uh, None of us are really 
the jam type of musician. Hello, I'm Alex. I'm Nick. And we are one half of the Arctic Monkeys, and you're watching GrammyPro.com. Come, come, come.